my god. That's a giant! Is that a carp? That's a trout! That's a giant! This is a tank! That's a giant! Oh my god! That's a tank! <laughs> oh my god! It's a tank! What? It's a tank! Listen, I'm gonna need you what to help me. What is that? It's a, it's a big trout! What is oh that? my god, look at this! He's ripping what like a that? king! He's ripping like a king! It's a big trout! Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Lord Jesus, I'll say a prayer. Please let me land this one. Oh, oh my God, it's a giant! That is a... Dude, Look at gonna... that trout! Dude, it's big! Look at that trout! It's big! It's big. Is that a lake trout? Dude, it's big. I don't care what it is! <laughs> it's a tank! <laughs> What's a lake? It's a laker! Yes! What are we doing? Yes! Oh my God, That's dude! A lake trout! Net it for me, bro. I can't get to it. Come here. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> what is going on? Oh my God, it's a giant! It's a giant! It's a giant! <laughs> what is going on? We thought we came down here to Dude, catch little brookie? rainbows. Is that a brookie? Is that a brook trout? Is that a brookie? That's a brook trout, that's not a lake trout. Oh my God, it's a what brook the? trout! Are you kidding me? It's a brook trout! <laughs> Look at how big this brook trout is. It's so big we thought it was a lake trout. It's a freaking monster brookie. Oh my God, Rob Roy is clearly, it's clearly fire, I can't even talk. Look at this thing's chops. Today's episode of Podsky Outdoors comes to you from Southern Wyoming, where we're fishing the outlet stream at Rob Roy Reservoir. Now, we had plans to come up here and fish Rob Roy. However, everybody we talked to that was fishing the bank told us fishing's not very good right now. Unless you have a boat, you may struggle from the bank. This is the month of August. It's really warm, and bank fishing may not be as good. Now, remember, we're not locals. We don't have local knowledge. We don't fish here all the time. We basically had three hours to come check this place out. Fish on, fish, fish on. Feels good, dude. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh my gosh. It's a nice one, dude. <laughs> oh my God, we just got here. First cast. Rainbow. Super nice rainbow. No way. No way. Throttled me, dude. Yes. Check this out. First fish at Rob Roy. Fishing the discharge here. What a nice rainbow. Yeah, baby. Oh my gosh. Good looking rainbow. Yep, really nice fish. I went deep again and got Look at the stripe on that boat. Oh my gosh. Holy gosh. Yes. Another Rob Roy rainbow. Really respectable size here of fish. They're fighting great too in this cold water. Another one. He's going crazy. Nice rainbow. Oh my gosh. Come here, baby. Really dark one. Yes. Alrighty, I want to break down my rig that you saw me catching all them fish on today. And basically, it's a fire float that slides on your line. So you can change your depth down to a split shot and a swivel, which what is that's what's let you that's what lets you run a leader. This is a four pound test fluorocarbon leader, about 18 inches in length, down to a size 14 fire hook. And today, what I did to switch things up was I switched between silver label and gold label, and I want to show you why I did that. The variation in the egg size is very, very important to keep getting bites. So I just switched between the two, and sometimes I would run two gold labels at once, sometimes one, or one silver label, and it was crushing these fish. And all you gotta do, I'm gonna show you real quick on the hook, what it looks like. 
When you're running silver labels, you definitely don't need to use two. But look at that hook size compared to the egg. And it just hooks right on your line. That's it, that's the rig that was crushing them here. You saw us get a ton of really quality rainbows and just an absolute savage of a brook trout. Oh, it's good. Oh, it's a big one. Oh my gosh. It's a big one, dude. Nice size. Oh my gosh. Nice rainbow. Ooh, yes. Wow. Nice colors. Oh, it's a good one, dude. It's a good one, dude. Oh my gosh. This spot's insane. Oh yeah. Tearing me up. Best color fish of the day. Really nice fish, dude. Here we are, Rob Roy, another super nice rainbow. Really good size quality here. Now we did stop at the great tackle shops right in the town of Laramie on your way out there. And they gave us some information, some of which was go to the outlet. Everybody knows about it. It's no secret. As a matter of fact, we found several YouTube videos on this area, also known as Douglas Creek. And sure enough, we came here and spent two hours here in the Medicine Bow National Forest where we're told this outflow, also known as the plunge pool to locals, is packed on the weekends. This is a very large deep hole, and it's filled with rainbow, brook, and brown, we're told. And the water is freezing. By that, we mean we touch the water and we're like, this is some of the coldest water we've touched in a long time, which is great for trout. Now, from what we're told, Wyoming Game and Fish does not stock this hole. All these fish come over the spillway, there's such a big hole, it's so deep, they live a long time here. Now we made a living drifting that current line. There's water coming out. We drifted the current line with two baits, gold and silver label, all on a size 14 fire hook under a fire float. And sure enough, we caught fish after fish after fish. Now, interesting thing to us is we were here at the worst time of day. It's like high noon. They told us we wouldn't catch any fish in the middle of the day. You gotta come here early or late. Well, after we caught a dozen fish in less than two hours, we just left. We had a great time. We said we've caught enough and we released all these fish for you guys to come catch. Now, you'll see us on this video talk. We get really excited. As a matter of fact, I thought the fish was so big it was a carp from what it looked like. Sure enough, it wasn't a brook trout either like we thought it was. We were later corrected by all of you Facebook biologists that it is a splake, not a brook trout. Now we did some research. The last time the state put splake in Rob Roy was in 2015. So that fish worked its way down here and it grew to a catchable, good, good catchable size. That's impressive anywhere fishing a creek. And we put it back, like we said, swam away for you guys to enjoy catching them. Now, we also caught a ton of rainbows in this area and some really good fish. What was important to us was changing the float depth. Sometimes we caught them two feet deep. Other times you see Jarrett using a 10 foot leader with the float down that deep, changing the depth, covering different areas. And you too could have an excellent day fishing here on the plunge pool below Rob Roy. Potsky products are available at sporting goods stores near you. If you can't find the specific color, size that you want, make sure to go to potsky.com. And as a thank you for watching Potsky Outdoors, we're going to show you a coupon code to be used for 10% off your next order.